Since 2011, HSN Cares and Habitat for Humanity have been helping women realize their dream of home ownership. HSN Cares believes in giving back. You're building lives. HSN actually cares. For the entire month of May, HSN Cares will donate $1 from every at-home item sold during at-home shows. None of this could have happened without your donations. Thank you for helping me make my dream a reality. HSN Cares is the heart of everything we do. Who knew a little piece of plastic could be so much fun? Now, when you apply for the HSN card, instantly get $10 off. It's all about you. Extra flex on the things you love. Now, when you use your HSN card, you get extra flex all day, every day, on all jewelry, beauty, and fashion purchases. Plus, no interest VIP financing, VIP easy returns, exclusive offers, all with no annual fee. Apply now. Call 1-800-695-1418 or search HSN card at hsn.com. So Ellen and I are talking about the, our today's special coming up. We're going to take one more last look at it, and Helen's rejoined me. And uh, we were laughing. When, when you yeah. see this thing, and you see Mark just tossing ice stuff cold. in <laughs> with no ice, you're going to think, that is impossible. It's freezing. And this is the very last opportunity, the it. last airing of the day. And our last look. So we're going to talk about it. Stick around. You're, you're not going to believe what you're about to see. <laughs> but it's true. Here it is. <laughs> Let's be really honest. What ruins a really good summer picnic or an outing than soggy wet food sloshing around in a traditional cooler? Imagine being able to end all that mess right here and right now using zero. Z-E-R-O. No ice. ice. I love it. No <laughs> ice. It is a revolutionary design. Yes, it is. In a cooler you probably have never seen before, and we have it exclusively in our configuration here at HSN. Mark Gill, welcome back. How are you? This is one of the hottest products you're going to see this summer if you can get your hands on it. Here's why. I'm going to show you how you can keep hot, hot, and how you can keep cold, cold, and frozen for up to five hours. Watch this, you guys. First things first, this is completely collapsible. So when it comes time for that cooler that's tough to store, this isn't it. And when it comes time to use one, two, three, and that's it. You've engaged our temperature lock technology. Now, what does that mean? Oh, and by the way, we're not going to start you with a small one. We're not going to get you going with a medium one or even a large one. We're going to give you the jumbo one right off the bat. 41 quarts. That's 60 cans of your favorite beverages for the summer. And guys, you got to listen to this one real close. Ice cold with no ice. Look at this, this has been in there all day, 60 degrees. Helen just about lost her mind when she opened this up and she went, Mark, do you know how cold these are? I'm like, yes, <laughs> Helen, I do. <laughs> because and you're we've expecting been that there's a ton day. of ice deep down inside Nothing. there somehow. It's not, you see, these are actually super chilly cold. Like exactly. the kind of cold you want to drink it right now and it tastes great <laughs> and it's it. very satisfying. Now I'm gonna go ahead and close this and remember you guys, this is two and a half pounds. There's not a lot to this, but these are stackable and they're made out of polypropylene. So that means you don't have to worry about the weight and how these are gonna hold up. Now, before we get into this, let's talk just for a second because I know everybody watches this and goes, I don't want a styrofoam cooler. Uh-uh. This is a styrofoam cooler. It's seven or eight bucks at the gas station on the way to whatever. It's gonna chip, it's gonna break. You still have to put ice in it. The handle's gonna rip out. The handle's gonna rip out. This isn't gonna last you the weekend. The chill chest is made of <laughs> Wait, poly... Wait, that wouldn't even last you an evening. <laughs> right, exactly. <laughs> Good luck. The chill chest is made of polypropylene. Now, if you're wondering where you've heard that before, crash helmets, bike helmets, and it's how they shape insulate and make light airplanes. Oh, That's how cool. they straighten them up. So guys, have a look at this. Here's your wow moment. Here's what everybody uses a chill chest for all year long. Groceries, no kidding. If this is all you get it for, you know what, you're gonna love it. Watch this. Next time you're at the grocery store, the big box store, your frozen french fries, your convenience foods, your ice cream, which you end up planning a trip around because you gotta get it home before it melts, is gonna stay frozen in the chill chest in your trunk with no ice for up to five hours. Your eggs are terrific. Your milk has no problems. All of your cream-based stuff, your butters, your mayonnaises, up to five hours with no ice. I can't stress how unbelievably cool that is. Yeah. <laughs> no pun intended. <laughs> 
<laughs> I love what it. He's been here, he's loved it. <laughs> uh, no, but here's what's really amazing to you. You guys are thinking, okay, that's why you just piled a bunch of stuff in there. Like, I know, because it's you can't touch it, you right. can't see it. But you'll see, literally, I can see the frozen frost, the frost on the pizzas. On <laughs> you can see the condensation on the milk, because it's exactly. still cold, but now the air's hitting it. And I'm talking about really cold. Not just, oh, Whoa. it's okay to keep it safe, cool. We're talking about actual cold here. And exactly. that, to me, is very surprising. Now, cold is one thing, but follow me over here. Think of this almost like an insulation box, guys. Look at this. Maybe you're picking up some drive-through on the way home or some takeout or maybe you're going to a party with the teenagers and they want to bring the hot food well guys look at this that same box is going to keep your cold cold and frozen frozen for up to five hours with no ice is going to keep your hot hot with no electricity for up to an hour. How do you think these guys get the food to your door Wait, and, with all these restaurants? And not lukewarm. See, no. I, I think if I was at home, I'd You're go, oh yeah, right, when he's saying hot, he means lukewarm, nope. like okay. No, nope. no, no, steamy, still hot. Let me show you our configuration because Absolutely. this is it. As Helen mentioned, we're not offering it again. This is it for the whole summer, by wow. the way. Wow. Once these are sold out, we're not, and there's a lot of spring and summer yet to go. There's a lot of events you've got. That picnic, if you boat a lot, if you go fishing, if if you're camping, anything. We know we all love to go out and we all use coolers all summer long. This is the one you absolutely want to get today. So when I open it up, let me show you. Look at this. I love this too. It is super cold inside here, like very cold. Very. The waters are like yummy, crisp <laughs> cold, right? Okay, here's what we have. We have divider walls that are exclusive in our configuration. So you get the divider walls, which are nice if you want to keep things separate. Absolutely. Then also, they have included in our configuration a special gel pack. And what wow. this does, it actually actually makes this ultra long cooling temperature. I could say supercharged. That. Supercharged, thank you. That's what I said last hour. It I supercharges it, it. So what happens is with this special gel pack, this is now going to stay cold, listen to this, for 48 hours. You do not need to use it. You don't have to have it for it to do its job, but it supercharges it for 48 hours. That's a heck of a long road trip. Out of this world. <laughs> Let me tell you something, you guys. There's a reason this is going to be one of the hardest items to get this summer, just like it was last summer. And so here's true. one of the reasons why, you guys. Have a look at this. This is your regular everyday cooler. This is the chill chest. So first let's talk size. This holds 41 quarts or 60 cans. This holds 41 quarts or 60 cans. But at the end of the day, when it comes time to store it that's and put it away, brilliant. that's the difference. So let me put this away for now and have a look in here, okay? This is everybody's picnic this summer. Just the nice quick one. The fruit is nice and cold. The desserts aren't melting. They're that perfect temperature. Like you said, the waters are crisp and perfect. And here's where it gets important, these sandwiches. These individually plastic wrapped sandwiches are perfect and cool and chilled and ready to go. And my my eggs aren't gonna kill anybody. That's pretty cool. <laughs> but guys, here's the difference. There's no ice, there's nothing to melt, clean, pour, worry about, and especially, there's nothing sitting in here that's gonna make me have to wring my sandwiches Ugh. out. We've Ugh. all been here, you guys. All this is is the ice that's melted from a day in the cooler. Mm -hmm. And this is completely normal. This is what everybody uses, you guys. This cooler works exactly how it's supposed to. There's nothing wrong with it. Kinda like there's nothing wrong with your VHS player. It doesn't mean you use it anymore, though. When you pack this up, you know at the end of the day you're gonna have water, mess, goop, soup, stuff to clean, stuff to scrub, stuff to dump, stuff to store, try and figure out where it's going in the garage, right? Or with no ice at all, you can keep summer cold for up to five hours, guys. Hey, That's pretty cool. And I want to repeat that too, because I really think when you're at home, it looks ridiculous because we're so trained to go, it's got to be on some form of ice, right? <laughs> right, exactly. You can buy those packs to lay stuff on. You can buy big ice bags to yep. put in here. Yep. You do not need it. You literally put your cold stuff in here and five hours later, you'll pull it out and <laughs> so guess what? Cold. It's still cold <laughs> with zero ice. Now think about this. We're trying, we're doing some math. How much is it to buy a big bag of ice? How much is that? Uh, three, four bucks. Three, four dollars. Okay. Four bucks. So, and then how much is it to buy one of those frims at flimsy little star from cool? 79 bucks. So, right. And and remember, that bag of ice, the full bag will not fit in the little cooler you just bought, right? So you're spending 10 bucks a round, you go on four picnics, picnics, you have to throw it all away and it's all a hot mess, or you get this one time and it pays for itself. That exactly. to me is remarkable. And my only advice is, and you had a great point too, when these here are out in the stores, and yes, you can get them elsewhere, you can't get our configuration, you cannot get our price, they're 
flying because people understand how brilliant the concept is. Right. Let, get beyond your I doubt. Mean. Get beyond the doubt right now and try it. If you don't love it, you can send it back for a refund. But imagine if it works. No more. Look at this. I can pick this up with one hand. <laughs> it's not because I'm a big guy. Have, look at no, that look, thing. I will never have to wrestle with this anymore. That's it. I don't That's have it. to have two big guys carry it for me. Right. Grab an end. <laughs> half of it's ice and the rest is piled on exactly. food. Exactly. We've got something cool to show you later for that. But for right now, these two chill chests hold every reason you need to have one of these, okay? And we're going to start with, have a look at this. Maybe you love uh, church lunches, potluck, taking the hot lunches at holiday time. And anytime you get to that place, whether it's a function hall or the house that you're going to, what's the first thing you're looking for? Space in the oven. Because on your way over there, whatever you're putting these in, which is usually just the back seat, it's not staying hot. Well, here's something you're going to love, you guys. These are designed to take food directly out of a 400 degree oven and put it right in your chill chest. Now, we recommend you line it with some Look towels it. to make life easier. But Look guys, at the steam, guys. The Can you steam, see it? the cheese, oh. the perfect. You got Now, by the way, look at my little, uh, my little handy thermometer here. 146 degrees, you guys. I don't need an oven where I'm going. This is already gonna burn my mouth. Look at that cheese. Now that's the hot, Crazy. okay? And it'll keep it that way for at least an hour. You're gonna love that. Here's what I really want you to see. And this is the part for me, and I'm like, you gotta be kidding. So here, look at this. I turned on my timer, my handy dandy little phone here, and we are at, what do we got there? Two hours and 38 minutes, you guys. That's how long ago, we took ice cream out of the freezer, put some of it in our chill chest, and some of it in the way that everybody recognizes. We have all gone and planned an entire shopping trip around a $2 quart of ice cream because <laughs> we have to get party. it home <laughs> right before it melts. So guys, here's what I want you to see. And this is, I can't do this demo enough. I love it so much. Watch this. This is two hours and 38 minutes on the counter, just like it would be in the back seat or your trunk, okay? You're going to get it home, open it up. Well, it'd actually be a lot are, worse because it's uh, somewhat chilly here in the right. studio. So this would be just soup. a soupy mess. That's yeah. all it is, you guys. Now, this is going to refreeze in your freezer. It's going to be hard as a rock, and you're just going to end up throwing it out. That's the problem we all run into when we go to the grocery stores and we get our frozen stuff. And our oh, by the way, if you're in a place like Florida, forget For, it. Oh. You have four minutes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now, guys, look at this. Same ice cream, same amount of same time. Same amount of time, right? It's been out of the freezer the same amount of time. You ready for this? Come on. That's cool. <laughs> I'm going to kill Suzanne with a spoon. Thank God eye the out. camera wasn't on <laughs> Man, I'd have been on the news. Look at this, you guys. It's real ice cream. Wow. It's not stuff that I can pour. And that's the difference, okay? Right. So when you're camping, hunting, boating, fishing, right. when you're heading out with the family, when it's a potluck, when it's a church lunch, no matter what it is you're doing, if you need to keep it hot or if you need to keep it cold, this is going to do it with no ice, and no electricity. How cool is that? Wow. Right, we're gonna check in with Helen because she is indeed outside. And Miss Helen, what are your thoughts on this, dear? Well, first of all, it's the very last presentation, and this is your last opportunity of the day. <laughs> the whole price, everything ends at midnight, so I'm glad so many of you are tuning in and everybody's rushing to the phones to get this. It is exclusive to HSN where you've got flex pay. It's only $13.32 for you to have a sandwich like this, and it's not soggy because there's no ice in here. There's actually zero ice in here. There's no ice, but everything stays nice and cold. You're water, your drinks are, you know, just as nice and cold. And you've got your salad, a fresh salad. Look, I've got a fruit salad in here. Now we started the day at midnight yesterday. This has been out here for 24 hours. You've got your delicious fresh fruit and you're going to save so much money by not throwing away food. And you're also, maybe you're going to have more fun this summer. I've just made a whole bunch of new friends out here. <laughs> We're all hanging out. And you know, I think, I think, I don't know if it's because, Hey Valerie, you want an apple? Sure. Yeah. <laughs> There you go. So have some have some water, Laura. I mean, you're you're enjoying yourself. You deserve a sandwich, Connor. Here's here you go. So uh, I mean, I love it'll keep cold food cold and hot food hot. And I love you know all the new technology. I mean, I don't have a rotary phone anymore. I've got a cell phone. You know that's the reason why you don't want to have those old-fashioned coolers that you still need to keep ice in. The technology is that you don't need to have any ice anymore. All you need is your chill chest. So it's so crazy, and I love the way it folds up. I'm going to keep it right in the back of my car. And I know, Suzanne, that, you know, our very last opportunity is right here, right now.
Yeah, it, Whitney, here's the thing. I just want you to think, and it's very true, this is the last chance, but think about Father's Day, because yeah. my husband's got an obsession with flashlights and coolers. <laughs> all, I don't know, I don't know what it is. All Could guys love coolers. <laughs> and you know what, I hate all those coolers because they're bulky and they're big, right? Yeah, because you keep lots of beer in them. I know, I get it. <laughs> you can hold a lot of beer in here, but look at this. Look at the slim size. It is the perfect, brilliant upgrade of a cooler. When was the last big jump and revolution of coolers? You ever thought about that? <laughs> No, think about You're it. You're right. It was a company a with a Y, and their coolers, because my husband bought one, is about 300 and some dollars. Yo. That was the next big jump. But guess what that cooler still needs at $300? Ice. And lots <laughs> of it. How about no ice, up to five hours of keeping things truly cold? Isn't that amazing? So I want you to think gift idea. I want you to think Father's Day. Father's Day for sure. He'll love this. And you all need a cooler. You know what I love too? If you have a coach or you're the soccer mom, mm -hmm. how often do you have one of those superstar soccer kids and you start at 8 a.m. in the morning and you don't come home till 10 p.m. at night because they're at a tournament. Oh my gosh. <laughs> you got to keep food in those kids all day long. Drinks, hydrated waters. We all know that. Yep. Grab one of these, and I'll tell you with our flex pay, I don't understand why you wouldn't try it. Because you know, and I know it's hard to suspend your disbelief, because you're thinking, I've been trained, we all have to have ice in every single yep. form I've ever used of a cooler. That's it. Get this at home. If it doesn't keep your things crisp and cool for up to five hours, or things hot for an hour, then send it back, we'll give your money back. I but imagine it. if it works just like we're saying, and quite frankly, I think even better. Right. Because we've heard some good stories about the length of time you can keep something going. Well, you know, we just got our hands on these guys. We haven't even had them all summer yet to figure out all the fun stuff we can do with them. We're just That's talking true. about the basics now. I can't wait till the summer kind of goes on and on and on and we start talking to people about the way they're using them and how much they love them. And That's yes, true. it really does do I mean, it with no ice. it's the beach, it's the lake, it's <laughs> camping, glamping, tenting, right? going to a picnic. Do you go to a summer concert? We just went to a summer production right? of The Producers. It was an nice. outdoor stage event. And guess what people drug down there? What? Big, heavy, bulky coolers because they wanted wine hey. and cheese. Exactly. and grapes and all that with ice piled in it, right? Man. Well, look at this, you guys. How about a better way? And by the way, I have a picture I'd love to share with you if we're able to throw it up there. Uh, a, a few weeks ago, my boy was the lead in his middle school play. I loved it. No one do like Gaston, no one. He was great. And so we decided to throw a cast party for everybody. So I have 60 uh, hormonal, upset, hungry teenagers at my house who all want to eat in the same five-minute window. <laughs> so here's what we did, you guys. We grabbed our, our chili chest and we put all of our burgers in here and man if I didn't have to think twice all day every time That's I open this to make burgers they were perfect so whether it's your so steak, you just have it right beside the grill right beside the grill it's like having an outdoor refrigerator really. and that's the point anytime I usually do something like this I'm looking for a fridge I'm looking for something I can plug in well imagine my surprise when I kept going for burgers hour after hour after hour and they were still cold great in point. fact almost a hundred of them in my chill chest and in my second one, have a look at this, all of my condiments, you guys. And as I'm pulling these out of here, the ice cold tomatoes, the onions, the pickles, the lettuce, as this is all coming out, understand, there's no ice. Nothing's dripping, nothing's and soaked. And they're really nothing, cold. They are really cold. Like the pickles are, the, 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 they're as cold as you would in the fridge. And they've been out in there it's all amazing. day. Now guys, here's where it really starts to matter, okay? Warm ketchup, kind of gross. Warm mayo, kind of deadly. Mm -hmm. You want to be very careful with messing around with temperatures, with mayonnaises and things with cream. Well, and how many things Hello. is that? Potato salad, eggs, macaroni salad, eggs. tuna salad, deviled eggs, chicken salad. All exactly. the salads we take to a picnic in the summer, they all have egg in them, and you got to be or mayo, and they got to be careful. You got to be really be careful, careful with that. And when you're done, you guys, this folds up. You're not looking for something to do with a giant, bulky cooler taking up room in the garage that you don't so have, smart. room in the shed that stuff gets piled on. The bottom line is without one single solitary cube of ice, you can keep all of your cold stuff cold and your frozen stuff frozen for up to five hours. And I've never in all of my years demonstrating products been able to make a claim like that on live TV. Get this home, put it in your trunk, put it in your minivan, when you go to the grocery store, when you hit that big box store, man, and you don't have to worry about running home with frozen ice cream, frozen popsicles, frozen this, frozen that, and you can enjoy your day, man.
right in and tell well, us and about just remember, it. I want to hear it. With our exclusive configuration, you're getting the two walls, plus you're getting the special gel pack. What the gel pack does, it supercharges the system and allows your stuff to stay cold for up to 48 hours. 48 hours. Is Love that it. not insane? And you can't you get this at retail. No, you cannot. This is from get, us. The only place you can get it is here exactly. tonight. Exactly. And tonight with our price and our value, it all ends at midnight. All right, checking back with Helen. She's moved over to the grilling area. Well, yeah, my favorite. <laughs> Oh my gosh, so we're out here in the woods. <laughs> and we were saying how the food has gotta be fresh because we can hear all the wild animals out here. They're smelling our food. Um, this is where we're keeping the chill chest warm. So I've got my macaroni and cheese. I've got baked potatoes, which are Still warm. If you got, I'll serve that for you guys. Um, and you know, corn on the cob, your fried chicken. You're enjoying everything and just popping it in here and having it stay warm for at least an hour. Warm. Uh, last presentation of the day. Uh, you know, the end of the day. I think so many of you have loved it. Over 15,000 now have been picked up. We're gonna eat the last of this because this is the last time we're gonna come to us. So um, you guys um, enjoy your ice cream. We're gonna enjoy our hot macaroni and cheese. I'll take any of that stuff. Hot, <laughs> cold, it doesn't matter. All right, so let's do some math. How much do you buy? And this is always desperation, right? And you think, okay, I gotta buy a big <laughs> bag of ice and I got this little cooler. And by the time I buy the ice in the cooler, it's $10, right? Well, a full bag of ice doesn't even fit in here. Nope. So you leave half the bag on the ground in the sunshine to melt, <laughs> and then you end up piling everything else inside here. And obviously it breaks. For about three or four rounds of that, <laughs> Just get right? this. Just get this. It's so portable. It's so lightweight. It's so smart. Exactly. And it's completely collapsible. I got to show you this, okay? And I'm going to do this on this red cooler. I talked about this before. I'm not going to make a big effort to try and make this thing look bad. It's doing a fine job on its own. This red cooler is 41 quarts. It will hold 60 cans. Mm -hmm. It's beautiful. This is 41 quarts, and it will hold 60 cans, and it's really beautiful. Because in this, I don't need no ice. Now, here's what I mean by that. My mom just went nuts. I talked like that guy. I said, listen to this, all right? This is insulation surrounded by hard plastic. It's 10 to 15 pounds out of the gate, but it doesn't work yet. You now have to run to the store and drop six, seven, eight, nine bucks on a couple of bags of ice. So listen to this. You have money invested. You know it's going to melt. You know you're going to have to clean it up. You're 35 pounds of hay grabbing into this so you can make that cold. Really? <laughs> right. <laughs> Come on, guys, right. you're going to spend that much money all the time just to keep this cold. Well, you know what? You can fit 60 of them in here without one cube of ice. And that's what the chill chest is going to do for you and this summer. And keep them as cold as if it were in here on fresh bags of ice. Exactly. See, that, that's where you got to get your head around this one, too. Because I know you're suspect. We've all been trained. I got lots of coolers, and we all got to go buy ice. There's a big business in ice bags. Right? Imagine never having to buy another bag of ice. Exactly. Just, you brought up a good point earlier. Yeah. I didn't think about this all day. Right. People are like, you know what? He probably got stuff at the bottom of there. You know what? Let me There's take sure. a few out of there and have a look. There's it's no, dry and these, you guys, these as a are, bone. These are freezing cold. <laughs> and they've they're been in like, there all day. They're the perfect temperature to drink right now and be satisfied. Exactly. So let me go ahead and move this out of the way. And I'm going to remind you that these chill chests are two and a half pounds. Well, guys, I got 50 pounds of liquid in here by itself, and I'm moving that around with no trouble because these are not styrofoam. These are polypropylene. And if you're wondering where you've heard that before, think bike helmets, crash helmets. The thing that keeps the airplane shape light and durable mm. is polypropylene, That's all right? Great. And here's the deal here. This is its thermal properties. And this is the reason that everybody should have one is just the trunk of your car. Shopping. Just for if groceries. Didn't, if you didn't do anything else but right. shop for groceries. If we called it the grocery transporter and this was our only demonstration, yeah. we'd be ahead of the game because here's the deal. You don't have to plan your day around frozen french fries, convenience food, eggs getting cold, or a silly popsicle anymore. Because anything you put in here from the grocery store, the big box store, or the convenience store, no matter what it is, hot or cold, this is going to keep it uh, cold with no ice for up to five hours. And listen, follow me to the one beside here, because this is the part that just blows my mind. The fact that I can do it without ice is one thing, but the fact that I can keep hot, hot, is another. These were here at the beginning of the demonstration. Remember that? Mm -hmm. So that was almost a half an hour ago now. And look, they're still 
Perfect, ooey, crazy? gooey, touch cheesy. Yeah, they they're really so hot. Are. They're That's ready to so eat. That's so insane. Isn't that great? And not just a wimpy, lukewarm. No, nope, <laughs> they're know? hot. Because you're seamy, thinking, seamy. oh, it's going to be hot. No, no, we're talking about hot, not just warm Love and it. okay. Exactly. It's hot and delicious. And I just want to show you one more time. We open this one up. Not a bit of ice. This has been here all day yes, long. Yes, it has. And I got to tell you, the celery is super chilly cold. Macaroni salad, I can salad. eat without dropping. This is, literally feels like it came out of the refrigerator. Right, it's got it, like a, a haze on got, it. Yeah, it literally feels like you just pulled it out of the fridge from our carrots. I love it. You got the chicken in there. This yep. is a good picnic yeah, we got going here. It's a good picnic. And the food just keeps coming out and it's all cold. And if I needed it cold for longer than five hours, no problem. We're going to give you that chest. We're going to give you the two dividers. And at the end of the day, for your next summer camping, cookout, fishing, boating, hunting, tripping, whatever it is, cool. that's your cooler all summer And long. you go up to five hours with nothing extra in it. And if you add the supercharger gel pack, it's going to go to 48 hours of keeping your stuff cold like it's coming out of the refrigerator. Love I it. just think this is the most remarkable <laughs> thing. All right, so here's what I want you to do. This is your last look. It's last chance. We will not do this again the whole rest of the spring and summer, and wow. we're just at the spring, right? The price obviously ends right at midnight if you're not familiar with that, and the flex pay will go away. So think gift giving. Dad's Day, what do you get that guy is hard to buy for? If you've got any coaches, any teachers you want to thank at the end of the year, it really is a clever gift, and they're going to go, wow, thanks. And we're the only one who has this special configuration. You will not get this at any store out there like you're getting it here on HSN. Of course, Flex is always handy. You certainly don't get that at stores. Mark, thanks for a great day. How was that? What are you do with all that ice cream? What are you going to do with all that? It's, he's got a lot of ice cream here right now. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of melted ice cream, actually. <laughs> right. <laughs> all right. I want this stuff out of the cooler. I don't want the melted stuff. Hey, by the way, don't forget, up to 30% off our top kitchen brands. We have so many wonderful brands here at HSN, some of the very best in the world, including KitchenAid, by the way. Check out what we have from KitchenAid. Um, um, but, little heads up, coming up at 11 o'clock, which we are about 30 minutes away from that, I'm going to have an entire hour of really awesome kitchen ideas. And in that hour, stick around, I've got something brand new from Cuisinart. You're going to be blown away. You've never seen this before. It's really cool. And we're going to have fried food that's guilt-free. I love that, but you got to stick around to find out what it is. Still more coming up as we get you ready for your summer. Helen's going to rejoin me here in just a moment, and we'll be back in just a sec. Don't miss a thing with our HSN app, available on Apple and Android devices. Get $10 off your first in-app purchase with code WELCOME10. Opt in to push notifications for early access to exclusive app-only deals. Shop faster than ever with exclusive new product videos, only on the iPhone. Watch HSN Live anytime, anyplace. And the new shop and search features make finding your favorites easier than ever. Search app on hsn.com to download. There's so many things to love about HSN, but one thing that makes shopping here fun is FlexPay. Get it home now without the stress of paying all at once. Why pay full purchase price today when you can pay over time? Buy what you want now. Pay it off later with your credit or debit card. FlexPay. It's that easy. Exclusively at HSN. It's Project Central around here. With just a little imagination, some of this, a bit of that, the possibilities are endless. Whether you're just getting started or you know your way around a glue gun, we have the supplies and ideas to help get it done. Say YES to DIY at HSN. We love our gemstones to be beautiful, colorful, and durable. That's why we give some of them a little more love. Enhancements may require special care and may not be permanent, while others may last a lifetime. For more information, visit hsn.com and search gemstone to see our gemstone enhancement chart. This last couple hours is all about getting you ready for the summer, and I think this next item gets you ready for just basically anything, especially if you're cleaning around your house. So the first thing is I walked into the set. We have not had the Dirt Devil on in a long time, so I was thrilled to have it back. And I looked at Julie and I go, oh my gosh, this is everything 
you could ever want to be able to clean almost anything you could possibly imagine in one fabulous kit, including the portable tote that goes with it. This is cool. This is from Dirt Devil. When we first launched this specific configuration, it was on the air for around $119. So what we did is we got a very special purchase. It's called Opportunity Buy. They don't have them very often, actually, but we discovered this one, and they said, look, if you buy every one of these we have, we will give you a crazy good discount. So we pass that on to you. Now, listen to this. You're getting what they're famous for the hand vac, but now it converts to being a really powerful stick vac because no, it's not rechargeable. You plug this baby in so you get max power in an amazingly versatile system. So Julie, do me a favor first. I know you're gonna demo away and we're gonna do, I'll hold that one for okay. you. Okay. I'll hold one of them Okay. Just really quickly show them everything they get. I know, and I love how you came out here and went, like, oh my oh. gosh, you're not kidding me. Okay, so you're getting, first of all, it's a hand vac. Dirt Devil is known for their hand vac right here so you're getting the hand vac and it converts into a floor vac okay so you're getting two floor brushes right here mm -hmm. this is your powered brush right here for pet hair for carpets and then you have a floor duster that's washable with your microfiber cloth and suction right there you get a pet hair tool or a upholstery brush right here every single vacuum company has a brush like this that they sell separately that's for true. 20 30 dollars you're getting that you're getting a crevice tool for areas up high like cleaning your bookshelves you get a duster that has suction on the side and then you have a specialized fan blade so for all the ceiling fans your flan fan blade goes right through there and there's suction along with it it comes with this great duffel bag right here for all of your articulating attachments. head yep That's the articulating that you can put these attachments on right here and then your hand vac at dirt devil we sell hand vacs that are cordless that are more expensive than this and it it's converts crazy. into the this. floor vac look at this. So, like a really this. powerful a two floor one. Vac. Isn't that awesome? Okay, so which okay, one so am I going to show this first. We're going to start with the floor brush. And this is the brush. It's great for your hard floors or your carpets. It's lightweight. It weighs about three pounds. It has the maneuverable head right here. And your wood, your tile, your linoleum, edge-to-edge -edge suctioning all the way across. And because it has the cord, it's <laughs> powerful. Mm, that's awesome. Yeah, check it and out. And it's so lightweight. And you know the vast majority of things you got to do around your house, you can do with this. Exactly. You know, you don't have to pull out that big, heavy vacuum cleaner anymore when you have this handy. Right. And you don't always want to get out the big guy. No, no. Also, you rarely never... do I want to get the big guy out. Right, rarely. <laughs> and you never have to buy a bag or a filter. There's no maintenance. You can just clean out your filter. Um, lightweight, portable, and tons and tons of power. It really, for everything that you get, the value is amazing. Incredible. Now, in your kitchen, underneath these baseboards right here that are hard to clean, and maybe your big vacuum is too chunky, well, Ooh, check that's this a good out. Point. Yeah, your big vacuums are not able to get in these tight little areas right here. It also lays totally flat which I'll show you in just a second, all the way down like this, which is great for getting underneath your bed. All the uh, dust bunnies yes, under your couch. all those little dust bunnies. And you right here, you can see. While I love it, it doesn't get under my couch. It doesn't, right. it's, the head of it's too The big. head of it's too yeah. chunky. And then you can go right from your hard floors to your carpets, um, your low pile carpets. It's great for getting up pet hair, the dust, the lint. Great for that top layer right there. That's great. Yeah, look at this, and it leaves carpet lines too. I love that. <laughs> and the head right there is maneuverable. Easy to push, lightweight. If you're tired of pushing those heavy vacuums, this is a stick vac with power. With every attachment, I, I'm just gonna say that you have never had a vacuum that has more attachments than this. I'm, I say that confidently. I know, you're absolutely right. I mean, I even walked in the studio, I'm like, this is everything you could ever want with I this. Know. We had to get the biggest table to put all the attachments, all the attachments on it. And they're like hardworking attachments. They're right. not blow off dumb ones. Exactly. You know what I mean? And they're not just for dusting. Every single one of the attachments has suction with it too. That's great. So, okay, Berber's hard to clean. In fact, sometimes those big heavy vacuums can tear up the Berber. Well, this is a great vacuum for the Berber carpets, or maybe your area rugs, or maybe the Sisal rugs. Yeah. And again, I want to show you again, it lies totally flat all the way down to the ground, and it still suctions. There you go. 
you never have to buy a bag or a filter. And then you can see how it pops off just like this and it converts it right into a, a handheld bag. You even have, how cool is this? A little crevice tool, we'll go through all the tools. A crevice tool oh, right man. on board there. That's there. And then there's your, it has a 26 foot cord. So you have the power the entire time. Okay, we're gonna go to another floor brush. You're getting two floor brushes. So it doesn't matter what's on your floor, tile, um, wood, your carpet, um, turn it on. This right here is a duster. So it dusts and then the suction is right along oh. here. When it gets dirty, you pop it in the washer and dryer and you wash it. So all oh, the that's hair. Brilliant. That is brilliant. Yeah, look at this. Wow. <laughs> you can dust your tile and then check this out. Your baseboards, you never have wow. to bend over. Watch this, how it flicks up like this and you can go right along the edge. So what it's doing is it's dusting right here and it flicks it off right into the suction right there. I mean, do you really clean your baseboards? Otherwise you have to bend over. No, but you kind of want to. Exactly, and you should because they get dusty. So that's the, you're getting the two floor brushes, <laughs> carpet and for your tile, and then you can pop it off right here just like this. I like that because it's easy. It's so easy, everything yeah. snaps on. And then with this one, I'm gonna put this on. Okay, so this is another one. It has the articulating right here, two pivot points. So if you wanna get up high, it makes it easy to maneuver right here. You can see how it bends forwards and backwards. And it's not, I know it looks like a duster right here, but there's suction right on oh. both sides. So, so what top of the fridge, hello? Top of the fridge, exactly. On top of it, there's a little shelf over here. And then again, you can angle it to where it's comfortable. It's got power, it weighs less than three pounds. So you can go over here, am I Oops. caught? Hold on one second. There we go, thank you, Suzanne. So you can get up high and look at this dusting. There is dust up there too, by the way. Right, I just exactly. saw it. <laughs> dusting, and so I'll turn it on so there's suction up there at the same exact time. So dusting. you're not just dusting it and pushing the dust off uh, onto the floor. Exactly. It's actually sucking it up at the do. same time. Now why is it two-sided? It's, so there's two different, this is just the little nubbies right here and then okay. this, or maybe you want to dust your TV. You can use this oh, right here, the oh, microfiber. Oh, that's a good idea. And you yes. can use it handheld too. Exactly. You can hook it on just to the handheld. On the handle. Right. And when it gets dirty, you pop this off, you put it in the washer and then you can put it back on. So again, it comes with everything. Mm -hmm. I'm going to get the handheld, um, Suzanne. I'm not sure, sure where, oh, I put it over there on the pet there, bed. Right. There you go. <laughs> Um, so you, you can see right there, you're getting all of the floor attachments. You're getting the handheld attachments. A great stair tool, by the way, which we'll show you how to use that. So many different attachments. It's value, value, value. We sell just a handheld Dirt Devil that's cordless for more money than this. And, and Dirt Devil's have, known for their And I have backs. to tell you, when they're corded, quite frankly, they're more powerful. And number two, you don't have to stop cleaning. Because exactly. what'll happen is you use a corded one and pretty soon it goes, you know, it starts to grind down. And you're like, oh great, I gotta go plug it in for a while. Then I can keep cleaning. With this, you plug it in, you get max power because you plug it in and you don't have to go and recharge it. Also, uh, this if you just detailed your car with it, which you're gonna show us kind of now, it's worth it, right? But the fact that you can do all those jobs that normally you have to pull out the big vacuum for was something so convenient because you could spend a lot of money just on a big vacuum cleaner and you could spend a whole lot of money just on a hand vac right just get it all and there's only one other time we've offered this configuration and when we launched it it was a 119 dollars they did a really special deal you've got a small little window to take advantage of it we bought every one they offered us we said we'll take them all but it's only for a very limited time because we just don't have a lot of them so if you're thinking about getting a big vac if you've always wanted a new hand vac because your old one is just biting the dust, now you really get the best of both worlds. And, and I like the fact that if you have trouble lugging anything, maybe it's your dexterity, Yeah, this is so lightweight. It's so lightweight. Yeah. The other thing, when we had it at 119, it didn't come with this floor brush right here. No kidding. So, I know. Really? So, so this it was is actually less. more tools for less money. <laughs> wow. So here it is as a handbag. This is what Dirt Devil is known for. If you have pets, this little brush right here, every <sighs> vacuum company has a brush that's similar to this. You can see how it pivots. Oh, get out of here. Isn't that awesome? I didn't realize well, it even pivot. I'm waiting for something to be wrong. I know. So <laughs> I come really over am. here. I want you to see how this works. So you turn it on. It's got the power, again, because it's a handheld. If you have pets, you want to be able to use this to get up the pet hair, the lint, and the dust. Getting up all those messes. Now, watch this. It goes, it flips down like this. <laughs> so now there's your brushes. Now you can turn it. 
so it's a little bit easier on your wrist to oh, clean. Stop. You can get in those hard to reach areas. Like just right along, and you know how your dogs rub up, rub up oh, right along cats. the couch? Yeah, cats will do and the too. cats do yeah. that too. And then you just pop the attachment out right here. Just like that. Okay, or let me show you this. The crevice tool is right oh, on board. That's so great. you're not gonna lose it. Take it out to the car. Get in those hard to reach places. Get all the french fries. Yep, all the french fries, all the crumbs. <laughs> you can get in those seams. Oh my gosh, looks like my kids were here. <laughs> <laughs> that is one dirty, <laughs> dirty that, chair. I'm just You never it. know. <laughs> there we go. Um, so yeah, so your crevice tool is right on board and then that pops out now. Okay, I get really excited about this brush over here. This is the floor <laughs> brush that we used with the extension. You can also attach it right onto the handheld. Oh, that's so smart. We never had this brush before at all. That's it's great. full power because it's corded and you can take it over to your carpeted stairs. You can also use the other brush, but I like this because it's designed for a standard step. You know what else would be nice too, Julie? If you guys live in a smaller home, if you've got a kid going off to their first apartment, oh, totally. if you live maybe in a studio or you've got a kid going to a door, they don't want it. They're never going to use a big old right. vacuum cleaner. Why yeah. don't you get them this and then they can still clean up, but it's not going to take up a lot of space. It's right. not going to take up a lot of room and it's very little effort. <laughs> yes, exactly. Very little effort. It is. The it really is. effort to clean. You, you know that. Get this. Now, the other thing about this, every single attachment that you have fits in the duffel bag. In fact, even the extension wand oh, will. folds up in and there. And I'll show you so guys this really quickly. This it's is big. so smart. Yeah. I mean, I'm thinking, again, we got summer on the brain. Campers, RVs. How many of you tent? We, I've actually gone tenting and camping like that. And you get so much dirt inside the tent. You're not going to bring your home vacuum cleaner when you're out camping, right? right? Yeah. But how cool would this be and how handy would it be? And it all fits in here. And they even give you this great little carrying case so you can take it with you. So yes. if you are traveling or you're going to go tenting or RVing or whatever, it's great for that. And it's really that time of year when we're going to hit the road. Exactly. Yeah. Lightweight. It weighs less than three pounds. I'm using that same floor brush just to show you. I love this. It leaves carpet lines right here. And that's some serious pile. Yeah, that's not a that wimpy is. little carpet. And this is great if you want, if you have pets, use this on your couch. It's easier than trying to lift up your vacuum, which a lot of people try and vacuum their couch with it's their true. big vacuum. It's very true. This is much easier. Show and then how again. you clean the stuff out too, will you? Okay, sure. So all you have to do right here, take it over, oh, and then great. there's all the goop. You never have to buy a bag or a filter. You shut it right inside there, shut it, and then your crevice tool is right in the back there. And this is Dirt Devil. They're known for their handbags. Mm -hmm. This is what they do. This is that great either a stair tool or an upholstery brush. And you can see how it has all the little pivoting. It pivots like I this pivots, back and really. forth. It goes upside down like that. And you've got the power. So it's cool. Corded. It's not a cordless. It's a 26 foot cord, which is nice and long. What about your pet beds? These turn in, they're, they're a nightmare. Whether you have a cat or a dog, they're hard to clean. You can't clean them with your regular vacuum. This is a great little power tool. Take it out to the car. Clean your car out with this. Detail your car. And you know why it's smarter? Because if you have a regular handheld vac, it doesn't have the brush power. Exactly. So it's nice because you'd just be taking the front of that in the crevice and trying to get all the hair up. Right. With the brush, it's actually scooping and picking up all of that hair and all that stuff on the floor as opposed to a regular handheld back. Definitely. Right? Okay, so now what I'm going to do, this is we're, great. we're saving the best for last. <laughs> Hold this up. Pretend I'm a fan. Pretend. <laughs> Pretend. <laughs> <laughs> and I've got a lot of dirt on me. Man. And I'm really, okay. really high up here. That's right. So <laughs> with the reach, put it on the extension one. This is a dedicated ceiling fan right here. Okay, and so it looks like it would fling the dust everywhere, but there's actually suction. Okay, right, good, I'm right here. There's suction here, and there's suction right along there. So, you're the ceiling I'm fan. The fan. Okay, all you have to do is you turn it on, and look at this. It dusts, and then the, all the dust falls right into here. So Instead of, like, you're not tossing it off the edge. Right, and if yeah. you have allergies, you want it to go in here, not all over the room, right. which is a great That just means place. more cleaning. Exactly. You ever get up there with it, like, you get, on, you get on a ladder, and you're up there, and you're brushing it off, and it's all just raining down on the right. floor? Right, and Guess then what you, you have to do? sneezing. No, you have to go get your vacuum cleaner and vacuum that right. It drives you crazy, right? Yeah, exactly. You guys, I'm going to show you this package is again. This amazing? We sold almost 800. 
hundred. It is a one-time deal. Basically, it could have been a today's special. It's such a good offer. It was called an opportunity buy. We don't get them very often, but they came to us and said, look, we have this many. If you take them all, we're gonna give you just a silly great price. And we're like, bring it, we'll take them all. It is everything you see on the table. And I think it's a little hard to understand. It's every tool you need to clean almost everything you can imagine, okay? And you get the carrying case to go along with it. Remember, you get the handheld and then you get all the attachments to make it a, a stick vac basically is what you're getting with all the brushes and the rollers, the crevice tool, it's all included in this one configuration. Just want you to point out our summer price for a limited time, we don't have a lot. Free shipping on this. That's the first time you're seeing free shipping in our show. And three flex pays. That saves you $11 just on the shipping. Also, think about if you've always wanted a second vacuum cleaner somewhere in your home. You know, Julie, like upstairs, because you just don't want to lift the big heavy vac upstairs. Perfect for that. Perfect for the second Perfect. vacuum. And remember, put it, um, all the little attachments in your duffel bag. Even the extension wand right here has a place in the duffel bag, so everything fits in there. It's nice and organized. I love that. That's nice. Less than three pounds. Great value. And is there just, if you're thinking about your stick vac, or you're thinking about getting a handheld, you get them both in one, which is brilliant. Yeah, brilliant. And you're getting a phenomenal price. All right, Julie, thanks for hanging out. You're welcome. Thank right. you, Suzanne. We're going to wrap this up. We still have more coming up, but of course, spring, what does that mean? Cleaning? Uh, cleaning and rain. Oh, spring okay. rains. Right. Yeah, I, I just, that was a test. She's like, she's like, I guess cleaning. cleaning. Right. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Or rain or both. And how do you handle the rain with ease? It's our better umbrella. Now, this is called the Compact Elite. We started out and sold, oh my gosh, hundreds of thousands of the big guy. And then everybody wanted a mini one, one that really would be very small as opposed to a long traditional umbrella. So they came out with this. It's the auto open and it's auto close. And it's an, an inverted system so all the rain doesn't come down on you it actually just inverts into it it's really cool if you haven't seen it great gift ideas in fact i've given several grad gifts using that for kids i knew would be walking along college campuses when it was going to rain so i thought it was a good idea all right check that out on hsn.com well we got a lot coming up including mother's day what does mother's day have to do with an air compressor i don't know <laughs> maybe she needs it <laughs> Hey, Helen. <laughs> hey, Suzanne. Every mom needs to blow up the pool toys, the, the tire for the kids to ride the bikes around the neighborhood. Um, we're going to continue this hour out. Yes, it's the Airhawk air compressor. Yes, Mother's Day, Father's Day, or just for summer fun. Hey, you get that blow up mattress. Hey, try blowing that up without <laughs> an air compressor. This is portable. So handheld. I love that everything is right here on board and you've got the battery that pops right out, recharges, comes with a whole little case. I actually had bought this for my boyfriend at the last holidays. I don't remember the price ever being this low though, $39.95, and we were all also doing three flex pay, so only $13.32 for this. We've shipped over 70,000 of these, and I know at this price we only have a few, th yeah, over 70,000, there it is. Air Hawk units sold since we launched it, uh, February 2017. That's right. And, you know, I, I know you're going to love it. We're bringing our special guest out, Lou Caputo, who lives in the building. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> we will never let you leave. It's true. <laughs> it's true. You are tethered to us. Tethered to the building. But you, you know what, though? I don't mind staying for this because yeah. this product right here is one of my absolute favorites, which I use on a regular basis yeah. because I have a vehicle that has a tire that seems to be getting low on air constantly. <laughs> right. So this is great to have. Now, you're getting an entire kit here. And I know we went over it again, but real quick, I want to just show you the features on this. Okay, so you are getting the Airhawk itself you see right here, okay? It has the rechargeable battery that's gonna come with it. Just fits right on there like it was a cordless drill, okay? Mm -hmm. You're also getting the charger. You're getting this unit right here, which looks like another battery, but what it actually is is um, an adapter that lets you plug it into your power port in your car. Oh. So if you ever do run the battery all the way down, you know, you can still use the unit itself. It has an 11 and a half foot I see. You know, I think I have an older model that doesn't have that feature. It actually does have it probably. You gotta look in the bag. Okay, look at me. <laughs> look in the bag. Um, and then, of course, you're getting the bag. Yeah, so you're I getting all that. that's why I failed shop class. <laughs> <laughs> but let me show you how this works. So on the unit itself, on the back right here, is a digital pressure gauge, okay? Uh, when I press the button and turn that on, you're going to see that's going to glow blue. Uh, the numbers are big. They're easy to read. There's a plus and minus sign. So you can hit the plus sign to add pressure, hit the minus sign to subtract pressure. So if you've got a car tire and it's 35 pounds, you hit the button until it goes to 35. It will turn itself off when it reaches the pressure. There is a flashlight on the front of this, as you can see right there. 
So when you're working outside at night, you mm -hmm. can see it. And then down here is where all the accessories are stored. You've got your needle adapter and you've got the, uh, what I call the other adapter, which is just pretty much for everything else. <laughs> but let me, let me show you how this works. So you're going to take the hose out of here and you first unscrew this little red piece in the front here and you press the hose into that. Now you're going to screw that on. And the reason that it screws on instead of like snapping into place mm -hmm. is that this is an actual compressor. So the air gets drawn in through the back here. There's a piston inside that goes back and forth, puts the air under pressure so that when it comes out, there's a lot of force behind it. Um, the, the things that you get with like your um, air mattresses, let's mm -hmm. say, those are more of inflators, a glorified fan basically. This is not that. So I'm gonna I put this into this basketball that's right here. And you can see that's dead flat. Watch how quickly we can inflate this from flat to full in just a couple of seconds with the air hawk. Now with balls like this, you don't really set the pressure. So that's done, okay? You just kind of feel it to get it to the feel that you want. Mm -hmm. Now something bigger, for instance, like a bicycle, that we would set the pressure for and it just so happens that I have one right here. <laughs> what a coincidence. What a coincidence this is. So I'm gonna come around here. Now, funny thing about bicycles, anytime you go to ride it, the tire goes flat. Yeah. I don't know what that is. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I'm not sure what that is, but look at this. This tire, definitely flat right here, okay? So let's imagine the kids and you wanna go out for a bike ride, everything's flat. Now, on the outside of the tire, it says what the pressure is supposed to be right on the edge. So we've already preset that into this. There's a trigger on the front here. There's a red trigger. All I'm gonna do is press that red trigger. The air hawk's gonna start filling mm -hmm. that tire. Now I can walk away and it's gonna go to that pressure. Now what I'm not doing is dragging all the bikes to a gas station, paying right. two dollars. Or that hand pump. Or the hand that pump. That I feel like I'm getting weaker and weaker. Exactly. Yeah, by the way, None if you that. guys own this, we would love for you to call in. We're here oh, yeah. live, right? Our toll-free testimonial Done. line. Oh, that's done. Finished. Okay, it's 1-866-376-8255. Or stay on the line after you order and tell us why you're picking this up. And it, so it stops automatically. It stops all by itself yeah. because I preset the pressure for that in there. So come on over here. Let's do something a little okay. more difficult. Okay, because you can use this on anything with a pneumatic tire, basically anything that has air in it. We're going to go down here to the okay. wheelbarrow real quick. Because right. um, the thing about a wheelbarrow is this is one of those things where you won't notice that the tire's flat until you put stuff in it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Right. It's the truth. So right now we've got about 35 pounds of, uh, 35 pounds, two times two, 70 pounds of river rock inside of this, inside of a metal barrel, okay? The tire, definitely flat. I mean, you can see, look at that right there. That is just dead flat, all right? So what I'm gonna do is, again, we've preset the pressure of the tire in the air hawk. I'm gonna press the button, squeeze the trigger, just like that. Now, walk away. Now, what's gonna be really impressive though is watch how fast it fills the tire, number one. It's lifting the metal wheelbarrow and 70 pounds of rock at the same time. Now, what am I not doing? I'm not emptying the wheelbarrow, right. not throwing it in the back of the car, I'm not driving to a gas station, right. praying that the <laughs> pump works, Yeah. praying I have quarters. Yes, and <laughs> so right, because air in. is not free at the gas station. But it is <laughs> when you have the air hog, and that's the big deal. Now, in just a couple of seconds, that's gonna be full. So if you have someone in your life that's a tradesman, mm -hmm. you know, that works out in the field somewhere, this is a must have for them. Great gift for Father's Day, Mother's Day too. Yeah. I mean, done. done. Look at that. That's it happened it. so quickly, I can hardly talk. Yeah, I know. And, and I know we're going to be showing you, you know, the car, but a regular air compressor is yes. huge. And that would I be know this. that even if you own one, you may not want to lug it out or, or just to, you know, blow up, you know, the air mattress or mm -hmm. the two, the pool toys. I mean, you think about this time of year, we get out the pool toys. Yep. If you're the one in the family, and I've been the one in the family that has to blow up the, you know, you get dizzy, <laughs> light oh, yeah. one yeah. at a time. I don't even know if I have the strength to do that anymore. <laughs> or pumping it up, and you think, Okay, well, how hard can it be? Let's talk about it's that. It's really hard. It can be really hard. No, it can be very, very difficult to do. And the thing about these pumps is, listen to this. <laughs> Does that sound in any way powerful or, you know, like confidence building right Sounds there? Sounds like it needs no. a little asthma inhaler. Needs, it needs a little something. <laughs> yeah, something. Um, you know, but the thing with one of these is, you, you're not going to use this to fill up a tire mm -hmm. on a bike on a car right. bicycle maybe it's going to take you a while it's going to hurt your back but you know what with the air hawk you don't have to use that um one of these guys right here this is a foot pump right okay mm -hmm. and um does it work yeah is it an aerobic workout absolutely because right. you're exactly. gonna be breaking a sweat with this and then we've got this guy now i used to actually carry one of these in my truck with me and the thing about this is that 
it's got to be plugged in at right. all times. Uh, yeah. And so basically you're tethered to about 11, 12 feet away from the vehicle at yes. the most. Where, you know, if you're down at the beach with the kids or you're on a boat and you've got uh, floats and things you want to blow up, air hawk goes with you. It travels with yeah. you. You can take it camping, take it on the boat, put it in the RV. You don't have to worry about being tethered to just a couple of feet right. within your vehicle. And completely rechargeable. And it's, totally. this is one of these items that you buy one and you always have it. It's not something like you need five different styles or yeah. you replace anything. It's a one-time one purchase. Size fits all. One size fits all. Yeah. And it's going to come in so handy. And you know, um, Lou, you know when the weather changes, my tire is one of those tires that yeah. like, I can tell the way, it's like a weather report. Right. Like when the, when the temperature drops, I lose pressure by tire. Of I've course. always got that one tire. And you, you know, you drive to the gas station and you know, if you, oh, you better have a working credit card. You got to put the quarters in yes. and everything. Not anymore since I do own the Airhawk. And yeah. I will say that it, I, I was actually surprised since it's so little that it, that actually, it would actually does do that. a car tire. So here's the thing. When that little light comes on in your car, right? It's mm -hmm. usually because your tire's down maybe five, seven pounds. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's all it is, okay? Right. But a lot of people will just drive around and around and around for weeks <laughs> with that tire down. But yeah. the thing is that when you're doing that, you're actually hurting the tire. So what I'm gonna do now is, let's, we, I, you know, I know for a fact we let about five or seven pounds out of this tire, okay? Okay. So what I'm gonna do is we preset the actual tire this is supposed to be set to, I believe it's 35 pounds, okay? I'm gonna squeeze the trigger, just like this. Real easy to do. Now, we're gonna do what I do best, we're gonna walk away. We're, oh, just gonna, go. we're just going to walk away from this. Now, what's going to happen is it's filling that tire. Well, we could be doing anything else we want. We could be, right. on, we could be out on the right. road somewhere. Get we didn't have to go to the gas station. <laughs> well, here's yeah. the thing. If you drive around with underinflated tires, you're burning more gas than you need to. You're and getting bad mileage. It's actually dangerous. It is dangerous because the car's not handling the way it's supposed to. Right. And you're wearing your tires out faster when you do that. And a lot of young folks out there, that light will come on, and they'll just keep driving around oh, for days. Oh, you tell me. I have a, for days. I have an 18-year-old dog. You know who does not know anything about it. It, it, this Done. is so easy like that there it is i mean it's, it it's, it's a great safety thing but it's also great and super fun in the summer you think about all those all, all the you know the toys and people come over oh. and visit the, the blow up mattress you know everyone's mm -hmm. got one of those and then you know whose job is it to blow up the mattress well you can't definitely do it by hand but you may have a bicycle pump or something but just you know it's so simple you'll be there all night yeah. it's just it's just like so easy and this is everything right here in this package i mean yeah. this is this is, with everything in here, you could fit this in your center console, um, you know, you could carry it in the trunk of the car very easily. It's not very big, you know, small enough that you could take it camping if you wanted to, if you had an oh, yeah. air mattress you want to blow up, I mean, those kind of things. Let's go over here again, because I want to show you, um, when you talk about blowing things up, right? I'm going yeah. to grab my, my friend over here, my scaly buddy <laughs> over here, the giant alligator pool float, because, and when I say giant, this is big, okay? <laughs> so I want you to think about this, though, and this happens here in Florida a lot. You pull up to the beach, you park the car, right? You walk 50, 100 yards down to the beach. You get down there, and all of a sudden the kids are like, you know, auntie, uncle, grandma, grandpa, can you blow, can you blow this up for right, me? Right, exactly. You know, yeah, okay. So do, are you going to trudge all the way back up to the car? No, if you have the air hawk, you can blow it up sitting right there. Same thing on a boat. You don't want to bring right. a float that's inflated on the boat oh, with yeah. you. You know what I mean? You want to blow it up when you're ready and to use way, it. by the way, it's 1.79 pounds. So yes, you're thinking you got to carry it with you. I mean, it's under, significantly under two pounds. Yeah, no, it is. And let's talk to the soccer moms and dads out there, the, the ones that volunteer, you know, to coach the teams and mm -hmm. those kind of things because when you go to practice with the kids you know you got those big mesh bags that are full of balls okay and if they look like this especially if they've been sitting for a while maybe even in the off season they've been sitting mm -hmm. you know what it's going to take you a long time to blow all the practice balls up but watch this when you've got the air hawk and again this volleyball is just completely flat here just about it's pretty it, i mean i wouldn't play with it like that right. watch this pull the trigger and you can it's like watching bread rise it comes yeah. up so quickly <laughs> right. just like that yeah, and that's about where I'd want that to be. Now look at this. Right, In just a couple of seconds, we did that. Now, if right. I wanted to blow up a pool float like this, what I would do was I yeah. would just take the needle adapter off. And again, everything screws on and off of here. And what I'm gonna do is, because I'm smart, I'm gonna place it back in the base of the unit where everything's stored. Then I take off my, what I call the other adapter. <laughs> the other, which goes for everything. For everything else. Yeah. I'm gonna put that on the end right here. And notice the shape of that. So that's gonna fit into almost any opening, even like a balloon yeah. for a kid's party where you gotta blow up like a hundred uh, balloons. Yes. You know what I'm talking about. I do. That's I remember perfect my daughter's Sweet 16. I actually went there a day early to start blowing the balloons. Just to do it. Just to yeah. do the balloon. And look at that. All I do is I just stick that in the back right there. Very simple to do. I turn the unit on and I squeeze the trigger. And again, when you blow something like this up, this is also done to feel.
You right. know what I mean? You just sort of feel. Yeah, you just sort of feel it. And you go yeah. like, all right, I want. Yeah, I like this. Yeah, I don't want to go much past that. But that's where that's where you oh want to get something like that. Well, we got our final, Simple to do. our final two minutes left. I do want to point out that it's on a price break. So Ooh. usually this is $60, $59.95. But in this presentation, we're doing at $39.95. That's $20 off. And we have a few thousand uh, at that price. So here's how it works here. When those sell out, okay. We're going to bring it back. It's going to, This is a huge item for the summer, for all the fun everybody's going to be having. It'll be $59.95 again. Uh, so $13.32 to get home, and that's any major credit card. The credit card you already have in your wallet, your MasterCard, your Visa, your Diners, your PayPal, your debit card. Uh, this can be the very first purchase you ever do. I, I did a bunch of presentations for this, Lou, and I finally said, mm -hmm. I, I, have to, I have to have it. And when I have to have something, I pretend it's a gift for my boyfriend. <laughs> Is that bad? I love that. Not bad. Yeah. I, 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 yes, yeah. I've bought many Here, things for my wife that way. For my wife Kelly. Yes, <laughs> for myself. Um, yeah. well, I mean, okay, we're going to do the bike tire one more time just because <laughs> for a lot of you, you're just breaking the bikes out because the weather's just getting nice enough to ride. I'm, and watch this. We have one minute. Watch this. I, that tire's very flat. We've already preset. We've already preset the pressure, and watch what's going to happen. I'm going to walk away and stand next to Helen right here okay, we're because back here. the no tires. Hands. No, no hands. <laughs> The, it's, a, it's a smart compressor. It yeah. knows when to stop. It's smarter than the compressor I have at home that, you know, I use for my tools and everything. Oh, yeah. And, and you know, a big uh, compressor, I mean, we've got one out on the table here. Oh, They're yeah. big. Done. And, Done. And Look what do you use? What are you going to use a compressor for? I mean, if right. you're using it to blow up all your tires and even your car. And a I suppose you had like a truck. Car, trailers. Yeah, truck. I, I have a truck and I can fill up my tires in the truck with that. That's 65 crazy. pounds of pressure in those tires. Yeah, and 1. this will work. 1.79 pounds, so lightweight, can yeah. fill up the air in a truck. I right. I mean, pretty amazing. So, Lou, thank you so much. I know this, You're like, absolutely flew welcome. right by. It did. Um, this is the end of our hour. You guys can keep shopping for all the great things. I know Suzanne is standing by. She's got an hour of cooking. A lot of great things in the mm. kitchen that she's going to be enjoying. Maybe I'll swing by, see if there's any food I'm left hungry. over. <laughs> so enjoy the rest of your day. I'll see you guys back myself in a couple of days, but stay tuned. Here comes Suzanne. Okay, we're talking about kitchen essentials, the stuff you have to have in the kitchen, stuff that makes your life easier in the kitchen. First item will do that. I do want to tell you, though, imagine being able to have fried food with no guilt. Stick around to find out what that is. But first, we're going to talk about prepping. I think deep in our hearts, all of us truly want to be able to cook more.